Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So in April of this year, as I posted, Microsoft was testing a new sidebar desktop option called Detach from Edge, which they were testing in Edge Canary version 114, which back then was the latest preview version. And just to do a quick recap, because I will leave that video down below if you'd like some more info, it was a new option called Detach from Edge that allowed you to separate the sidebar and side panel in the desktop browser from the main edge window and attach the sidebar to your desktop as a standalone widget, very similar to how it was back in the day with Windows 8 with the charms bar, which was a feature that did roll out with the original release of Windows 8. Now, as mentioned, I'll leave a link to that video down below so you can go check that out for more in-depth info. But I don't know if you have noticed that uh, in the preview versions of the browser like Edge Canary, since I did post, uh, Microsoft removed the attach um, option, the detach from edge and attach the sidebar to the desktop option, which um, is no longer enabled by default uh, in the preview versions and Edge Canary, and it never actually made its way to the stable version. But nonetheless, just to let you know that it is still possible to enable this feature uh, in the stable version, which is currently sitting on version 115, and the uh, a beta dev and Edge Canary versions, which Edge Canary is currently sitting on version 117. So if you'd like to re-enable um, the sidebar feature detach from Edge in the stable version and also in the preview versions, we can do so using a command line flag. But just to give you a heads up that currently um, this feature will work using a command line flag, but um, it may be removed when Microsoft starts pushing out the Windows Copilot. Um, to the stable version of Windows. So um, currently this still works, but could be removed any time by Microsoft, so just keep that in mind. So to enable a command line flag, um, you just head to a shortcut of Edge, be that on your desktop, in your start menu, or in my case, on my taskbar. You right-click on that shortcut of Microsoft Edge, you click on Properties, and then here in the target field, as many of you will know by now who do view this channel, you will see the target ends with .exe quotations. You leave a space and you delete anything in front of those quotations. And after you've left a space, then you paste in and enter this command line flag. It's quite a mouthful. And I'll leave a link um, down below in the description to this command line flag. So you can just copy and paste it for easy access and reference. But just remember though, that after the .exe quotations, you must leave a space else this will not work. You click on apply, you click on OK. And then what I would suggest is just closing the stable version of Microsoft Edge and then relaunching the stable version to apply that command line flag. And now you'll see that if we head to the bottom of the sidebar, the detach from Edge option is available. And if we click on that, it detaches the main browser window from the sidebar. And if we just minimize the main browser window, you can see, um, as I did mention in that previous video, you now have the sidebar and the side panel options available as a widget that's now pinned to the desktop uh, in Windows 11. Very similar to what Windows Copilot's going to be. So I can actually see that Microsoft will eventually remove um, this experimental or this command line flag, sorry, this command line flag in the future because obviously this will be replaced with Copilot. But nonetheless, that's how you can re-enable that detach from Edge option in all the versions of Microsoft Edge for desktop. And as I did mention uh, previously, if you want to reattach the main browser window to the sidebar, you just head to the bottom, click on Attach to Edge, and there we go, and everything is back to normal, and everything is reattached, and the browser has become basically a whole unit once again. And if you want to um, disable that flag to disable this feature, you just right-click on the shortcut once again, you follow the steps in this video, click on Properties, and you just delete that command line flag, click on Apply, and then close uh, the browser and restart the browser, and then that option will be uh, disabled. But nonetheless, that's how you can now uh, uh, re-enable the Detach from Edge option in Microsoft Edge for Desktop using that command line flag. And as mentioned, works for now, but that flag may be removed by Microsoft in the near future. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.